Before coming to Williams, I did a lot of community service in my neighborhood. I knew that it was something I wanted to continue here at Williams. I got involved by just volunteering my freshman fall. I came across this program known as Berkshire Prom Center in Canaan, New York. It's an alternative sentencing program for at-risk boys from the New York area. I grew up in Brooklyn, New York, and a lot of what these young men are going through, I've seen in friends or like friends of friends. So I wanted to be a role model for the young men at Berkshire Farm Center. So do you find yourself doing a lot of like practice exams and and there's also a website that you can go to and, and to get like sample questions. Have you been using that a lot as well? Never. Oh, okay. <laughs> working with the youth there just provides me with a sense of hope that simply working with other people and forming connections can really provide change in someone's life. Our students, I think, learn that they need to look for ways to engage and that if they do look, their looking is rewarded. This is a pretty wonderfully comfortable place to learn for four years of your life. But the world is more complicated than that, and it's our job to be real with our students about that and to support them and accompany them in their encounters with those true things about the world beyond the edges of this place. If maybe somehow we could get the freshmen in involved in delivering, actually delivering the food and getting to see some of the families and kind of see the conditions in, in North Adams. Getting involved here has been something that's really meaningful to me and something that I express much passion in. I find myself being more open to trying different things, emerging from my comfort zone, and by doing that, having the courage to get my peers involved as well. I'm an intern for the Center for Community Engagement. I keep the door open for students to come in and ask about any community service opportunities for us to, you know, dedicate that time to go there five hours a week. I think that's really that's really powerful. Like I told them I was honest with the with the kids there and everything. I was like, I've never done this. I'm afraid. Classmates are generally very passionate about meeting people from different communities and volunteering in different areas in the Berkshires. So that's definitely something that keeps me encouraged and inspired and enthusiastic about the work that I do. There are many different ways to get involved at Williams. You have the Habitat for Humanity group, RAPS, tutoring opportunities. You also have Berkshire Farm Center. And there are students on campus who also help maintain Hopkins Forest. So there's something for everyone, whether you're passionate about arts or activism or social justice, and even nature, there's an opportunity for you to get involved. We are in the process of growing, or maybe I should say deepening in our in our ways of thinking about engagement. So this is not a static program. There are a bunch of courses in our curriculum that are fueled by this energy of community engagement and fuel it. I take a lot of what I learn in the classroom and bring it to a real life situation where I am being more proactive and giving back to the members of my community. Part of the purpose of a liberal arts education is to educate whole people for whole life and that's about minds, but it's also about hearts, consciences, and community engagement is our way of putting knowledge to work, plowing it into the furrows of the waiting field. I think the experiences I had at Williams, the opportunities to work with people that were different than from me, that had different perspectives, different ideas, is that which has allowed me to do what I'm doing now and brought me to DC Central Kitchen. DC Central Kitchen prepares about 5,000 meals every day mostly with rescued food that we deliver to homeless shelters, transitional homes, halfway houses, and other social service agencies. I think people come out of Williams realizing the incredible opportunity they've had and take that as a responsibility to have an impact on their community. The students, to me, seem wildly invested in solving these issues that affect all of our communities, whether it's in Williamstown, in Massachusetts, in Washington, D.C., or around the world. When we open the door on the edges of this campus, what is waiting on the other side of it is not just the community right around us, it's the globe. All the membranes are so much more permeable than they've ever been before. Acquiring those skills needed to farm a nourishing environment for our grandchildren is definitely something that we can start doing today.